if you're properly building your business, you can actually work smarter, not harder, and you can get a 10X multiplier for less effort. It took me 14 years to go from startup to $35 million in revenue. And my business was earning about two and a half million, even though I sold it for one of the highest values because of what I built for 150 million, it still was 14 years to get there. With Grant, in our fourth year in business this year, we're on pace to do about $135 million in revenue. And our profit this year will be greater than the total revenues that I had the year I sold. So when people wanna talk about 10X, Here's the thing, imagine taking 14 years to build a revenue base of $35 million. And then imagine in our third year, the year we just finished, we made $35 million in profit. So imagine 12 to 14 years to generate 35 million in revenue, 36 months to make 35 million in profit. So that's a true 10X. And what Grant is a genius, as is Elena, they are remarkable in finding the closest way to move from point A to point B structurally. And, and what they do is they challenge you to move through those faster. So when I showed him my breakpoints that I've been building since 2010, he was like, dude, if we could pull businesses through those breakpoints faster, not just by educating them, but partnering with, coming alongside of them, deploying, training their teams for them. If we could do that, everyone in the ecosystem could move 10X. And so this is the thinking that Grant and Elena bring to the equation because, you know, there's no 1X or 2X or 5X. If we can make an incremental move what do we need to do to 10 times that move next year? So you're always being pressed to think more, increase activity and get bigger results. Now people get confused with that. They think, oh, all you need to do is just increase your activity 10X. The truth is you have to be thinking, I gotta increase my activity 10X. But if you're properly building your business, you can actually work smarter, not harder, and you can get a 10X multiplier for less effort. And people that ask me, they're like, how can you possibly do that? I'll tell you how. If you're the business owner and you're grinding and pushing and grinding and working 15 hours or 18 hours and under pressure seven days a week, you can actually achieve a 10X growth by finding 10 people to do one tenth of the things that you do teach them to do it as the team, and then they multiply by 10. So your results multiply. That's how you go from 1 million or 100,000 to 1 million, 1 million to 10 million, 10 million to 100 million. And what we're doing right now is demonstrating that in real life. So imagine you can be trained by the people who went from dead stop, no deployed capital, no startup money, we don't have one penny in this company, to in our fourth year, we'll do $130 million and make $50 million of profit. Now. If, and I'm not afraid to open my books up. You know, the other thing is when we first started trying to figure out who should we partner with, my wife, Natalie's like, you should look at some of these social media influencers. I'm a traditional business guy. So I'm like, uh, I don't know, let's look at them. And she starts showing me these people. I'm like, this is a joke. These people do not know what they're talking about. The first book she forced me to listen to is 10X Rule. And at first I resisted it because of his online persona. First thing I saw was this guy with his hat on crooked running in front of an airplane, throwing money in there going, hey, 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 Grant Cardone here. And I was like, oh man, I can't have anything to do with this. It's like cartoon hour. But once I les listened to 10X Rule, I was like, okay, this guy knows what he's talking about. So we went to the 2019 growth conference. We did not know him. We didn't know anybody in his organization. We bought front row seat tickets for 35 grand. Dear friend of mine, one of my closest friends and mentors, John Maxwell was speaking there. We went to dinner with him the night before. John looked at me and said, what are you doing here? I looked at John and said, to check out if this guy's the real deal or not. And so in fact, I was just editing my book that's gonna go, it's my first book. John wrote the forward for it. And I was reading his forward and he talks a little bit about his and my experience together over the last 12 years, but what a pivotal moment this was watching this explosion happen by partnering with Grant. And what I'll tell you is when you get around the right people with the right intentions, and especially when they're the right type of mentors, there is no limitation other than the limitations you impose on yourself or your community has imposed on you. So if you're pulling P-O-L-L-I-N-G, your friends, your family, your lawyer who tells you not to take us any kind of risk, who works by themselves, of course, your accountant who's telling you you should not make an investment and they're working by themselves, your friends are telling you don't hire any more people and all the wrong people that you're listening to. So if you're pulling P-O-L-L-I-N-G, you're getting pulled P-U-L-L-I-N-G.
eating down because everyone's self-limiting thoughts are imposing your ability to be creative. So your job is to pull P-U-L-L, pull yourself up to someone who's an example, learn from them, add value to their life, and they'll add value to your life. And if you can live that way, you'll attract remarkable people around you.